good afternoon this is Tim Nash from the Shropshire Star bringing the latest on Shrewsbury Town and uh, any uh, elation and there was plenty of it in the, uh, the away end in the visitors dressing room at Barnsley on Saturday uh, was uh, perhaps tempered by the early departure of midfielder James Weselowski uh, after just 15 minutes at, uh, at Oakwell. The, Aust the popular Australian midfielder who's battled back uh, so gamely after um, uh, seven months out with a cruciate, uh, cruciate uh, needle ligament damage um, uh, it lasted just a quarter of an hour against the Tykes and um, we don't yet know, uh, we're still waiting for confirmation of, of what exactly is, is, is the problem uh, but he did go off clutching his knee and uh, that's uh, uh, of course a, a big worry for town boss Mickey Mellon and, uh, and the fans um, so we'll bring you the latest when we have it maybe, uh, uh, well hopefully, uh, hopefully as quickly as possible uh, on that but um, again as, as, uh, it's Great to see Town get off the, get off the mark. Uh, their first league uh, victory of the season, inspired by Jordan Clark, who is of course a, a former Barnsley man, and uh, he's put himself in the frame for uh, some more regular football now, playing uh, just behind uh, lone um, uh, target man uh, Tyrone Barnett. Uh, so, uh, <coughs> oh, ho hopefully, more to come from uh, from Jordan. Also in today's Shropshire Star, we rejoice in the uh, Shrewsbury Cricket Club's uh, Birmingham League title triumph. Um, they lead the, the back of our Shrewsbury edition and rightly so after uh, deservedly earning their third uh, Birmingham League triumph in six years uh, with a 113 run uh, win against uh, Warmley at the weekend. Uh, this of course all with uh, one game still to go and it was uh, an inspired show from the Barnard brothers with uh, brothers Ed, Mike and Steve Barnard responsible for all ten Warmley wickets. Uh, so uh, enjoy our, uh, our full report and pictures in today's Shropshire Star.